Yes, it's me, Mark Evander here again today. Well, according to Caswell, there is no such thing as a minister of state. And the Constitution don't provide for it. You can't have two ministers in the same ministry according to Caswell. Well, I want to tell the honorable gentleman, you know, the former senator, we have had ministers of state for generations, going back to the days of independence and coming forward. Well, I can remember some of the names of them very well. We have also had a senior minister as well, and the deputy prime minister. Does the Constitution recognize these things? Maybe not. But does the Constitution say that a CEO, which is what a Prime Minister is, cannot have a Deputy Prime Minister or cannot have a Senior Minister? Yeah, that's not where market coming from. So I think this is much ado about nothing at the end of the day. After all, a CEO could create whatever is needed. You know, look, in the old time days, huh? You know, you didn't have a director of communications. You didn't have... But times change. Times evolve. Forty years ago, there was no need for a digital guru or, you know, specialist in IT and so on. Try to get by today without an IT specialist in an organization. Or try to get by without somebody who understands digital media. Huh? Those times are different times to these times. You can't just stick in the mud and don't ever evolve. Huh? What old time mechanic today would even know how to open a car door? Go for it, touch it, you say click, click, uh, it lock or it open. It ran by computers. So a man that only know about water pumps and fan belts, well, he can't go down inside them modern engines other than to look at it and wonder how for. Well, well, well. You understand how things are? So these things change, things evolve, and you gotta move with the times. And look, as the bard would say, a rose by any other name would still smell as sweet. If, for example, the Jamaican offer you a guinep and the Trinidadian offer you a chinet, huh? I'm still a Aki to market vendor, huh? Oh, last. And if you tell me that in Trinidad and Tobago somebody offer me something called Cascadu, huh? And I go on Guyana, huh? And critic down there offer market vendor Hassa, huh? It is still the same fish at the end of the day. And whether you call it Mahi Mahi or I insist on his dolphin, it goes still to your sweet when it come off the grill at Uncle George or down at Shaker's restaurant. Huh? My Italian friend said to me, he said, you know, my friend, you know, I said to you, I see you liking the pasta. Eh? You liking the pasta. I tell you, I know I'm not liking the pasta. They said macaroni poi, my brother. Poi. Huh? <laughs> and if the overseas people want to insist the market and say, oh, I see you're eating yuca. I say, yuca? Huh? No, no, no. There's cassava, boy. Cassava. Yes. Huh? A pumpsy tear. Uh, in Trinidad, is still a goal in Apple in Barbados. So it really don't matter. Football is soccer, ain't it? And a donkey and an ass in the same thing? <laughs> Listen. At a West Coast restaurant, uh, Chateau de Tap is still water or a Bomaston. And as I tell a waitress who offer me still are sparkling, I tell you, sweetheart, the only thing that's sparkling but here so is the prices but that menu and market can't afford it. <laughs> you see me market vendor? I go for now. But you have a blessed and a wonderful day. Yeah? <laughs>